So hi friend, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video. So as I promised you, I will provide you the detail of all shift bonus and errors. So I am here with the video that is here. I will talk about J mains 2021 August attempt all shift bonus plus error. So here you will get shift wise bonus plus error. So I will also talk about the benefit and loss of bonus and error. If there is more bonus marks in your shift, you will get benefit of that or you, you will have the loss. So there are total 12 plus bonus plus error that has been encountered till now. So if you have any more after watching this video you can ask in the comment section so i can provide you whether you should challenge or not and also i will talk about the whether you should challenge a question or not without challenging also you can get the marks or not so all those things i will talk i will talk in this video so if you are first to my channel please try to subscribe the channel so that you will get all the information about j mains j advanced other entrance exam other counseling also in this channel only and similarly i will provide you the video after the final final answer key will be released after considering all the bonus and i will provide you the similar video in which i will provide provide you all the detail about the about the bonus and error that will be after the final answer key so please try to subscribe and one more important information that is if you need counseling guidance that is the complete counseling guidance are starting from your choice filling till your admission is done and not only j mains but other counseling also once you register with me i will guide you for everything and you will get the best out of your rank that is my responsibility once you register with me so if you want counseling guidance then contact me through instagram or whatsapp number available in the description box but if you need counseling guidance then only because for that you have to register with me then i will guide and i will take responsibility of your all counseling and i will also provide the decision making whether you should go with uh, this college or the whether you should go with this college or this branch or this nit or that nit so all those things we can discuss because this is about your career so you have to take the decision very carefully if you have any experienced person you can tell from that. them but if you don't have you can contact me anytime through instagram or whatsapp number but if you need counseling guidance then only so let's start this video so here is the bonus and error of 26 shift 1 related to physics problem in the answer of this question that is the 26 shift 1 try to listen it carefully that is the official answer by nt is 1 and the official answer answer key by ln is 1 and 2 so if you have provided the answer as 1 or 2 you will get the marks don't worry for that and you can really trust this information because these are from ln so they always provide the bonus and error about the about each attempt of j exam and mostly though those are equal you can consider yeah, this question cool. as correct if you have provided an option 1 or 2 and you can add your marks in your expected marks. The so next question next from 26 shift 1 is uh, from the uh, mathematics section. It will be bonus because there is a problem in the question statement. Uh, if you want to check your uh, marks versus percentile, that is for each shift I have already provided for this August attempt and in yeah. previous attempt also I provided it is the accurate data. So now you can also check about uh, that. Uh, you will get the link in the i button as well as in the description box. That is each shift marks versus percentile from 40 percentile till 99.9200 percentile and also the expected cutoff marks for j advance how much marks you should have at uh, least to, to be get. eligible for the j advance examination so this is about the 26 uh, shift so the next is 26 august shift 2 so here is the question that is the only question that have some problem that is question will become bonus because there is some problem in the question statement the official answer is 2 but it will be bonus because there is some problem in the question statement so now let's talk about some questions should you challenge the uh, question or not so i will suggest don't challenge because there is so many a student right. appeared in your okay. zip particularly so don't need to challenge the question because anyone a student will challenge the question then you will all will get the marks whether it will be an error or it is it is a bonus so it's my advice uh, you don't need to challenge if you have so much eager to challenge you can challenge by paying 200 but i will suggest don't go for the Why? challenge so next question is what is bonus so if any question have problem that is the question statement uh, there is no right answer in the option that is all four options so that question will become bonus and in that case every student will get the mark so next is what is error so, so error means there is uh, there is two possible answer of that question or they have provided the wrong answer uh, instead of option one they have provided option two and in the integer type question if they have provided something wrong integer answer those type of problem considered to be an error in the question now, who will get the benefit and loss of bonus and error so try to listen it carefully if any question become bonus in that case the student who have done uh, done the negative marks in that question they will get the benefit uh, because, because those are student will not get the negative marks in that question but the student who knows the concept well about that question and attempted it correctly but the question become bonus 
in that case those student have lost because they will lose their four marks so uh, this is the thing about the about the bonus but if a question become error in that case the student who haven't uh, attempted that question those student will not get any type of benefit but the student who have attempted it correctly they will get the marks otherwise they will get the negative bar so this is the thing about the bonus and error so hope you have understand this point try to listen it carefully how so many student ask in the comments uh, comment section about this type of thing so i have clear it in detail so, so here is 27 shift 1 and shift 2 so here, so here is the question that is official answer and key is 4 but ln answer is 18 that is the integer type question question number 7 of 27 shift 1 and here is about the SIP 2 that is one question are related, related to mathematics section that is the official answer by NTA is 36 but Ellen claim it as a bonus question because the question statement have some problem so next if you talk about 31st SIP 1 so here is the question that have problem uh, that is the question number 11 related to physics the official answer by uh, NTA is 3 but the official answer by Ellen is 1 and I hope this question will be overturned and if you have provided option 1 as correct answer you will get the marks here is the next question that is the official answer by NTA is uh, 1 but Ellen claim it as a bonus question so if you have attempted this question negatively then don't need to worry you will not get the negative there marks is one more so question that have some problem that a student have claimed in the comment section yeah, so, so check it there is no claim by a particular institute on this on this question but there might be some problem that's why the student have asked uh, so you can check this question also and you can expect if there will be any problem in this question the answer will be overturned so next if you talk about 31st August SIP 2 so here is the uh, uh, question that have some problem that is related to chemistry so official answer by NTA is 3 that is the third option but ln option is 4 so this type of question is considered to be an error question so if you have provided option 4 as answer you will get the marks don't worry for that so next question is again related to chemistry this question also have some problems so if you have done negative in this question you will get the bonus marks so next is uh, September 1st that is the last day and uh, there was only one shift as you also know so here is the question this is also related to chemistry that is official answer by TA was 4 and uh, but Ellen claimed it as 1 and 4 both will be the right answer so if you have provided 1 or 4 you will get the marks I think one more, so, one more question there is some problem about that that is related to physics that yeah, is related to semiconductor diode so this question is not claimed by any particular uh, institute but the claim has been made by a student in the comment section so I have listed here so if you think this question have some problem this might be overturned but it is not uh, confirmed so, so this is all about the all shift bonus plus error i have provided you all the details uh, what is the meaning of bonus or what is the meaning of error and so do you challenge the question or not what is the benefit of bonus and error so all those things i have provided in this video so hope you find this video very useful and try to subscribe this channel so that i will provide you the next video similarly uh, after the announcement of final answer key so that you will know about the actual bonus and error that will be announced after the final answer key so please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get all those updates in the future also and one more time i would like to inform you that uh, so if, if you need counseling guidance for josa or any other counseling that you will do this year you can register with me then i will guide you for all the things starting from choice filling till your admission is done and you will get the best out of your rank that is my responsibility and not only in josa but other counseling also once you register with me then i can discuss with you everything where you should take the admission where you should not which branch you should take which branch you should not because it's about your career uh, so try to contact me if you need counseling guidance then only because for that you have to register with me and you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number available in the description box thanks